Certain people in the public eye can become a target for attempts to compromise accounts on social media platforms, including Facebook. Accounts that face increased risk may need additional protection. That's where Facebook Protect comes in. Facebook Protect helps these high-target accounts adopt stronger security protections by simplifying security features like two-factor authentication. It also provides additional security protections for people's accounts and pages, including monitoring for potential hacking threats. People who may be eligible for Facebook Protect will see prompts on Facebook to learn about the program and enroll. Facebook plans to continue expanding this program globally in 2022. No action is required unless you get a notification on Facebook that you are eligible to enroll. If you have been given a deadline to turn on Facebook Protect and have passed the date, your account may be locked until you turn on Facebook Protect. If your Facebook account has been locked, proceed to click Turn on Facebook Protect. You can learn more about Facebook Protect and then click Next. You can read more about this security feature and then click next to check for vulnerabilities on your Facebook account. In this case, it has found a problem and suggested turning on two-factor authentication. Click on the Fix Now button. Click the Turn On button. There are three choices for the security method and the Authenticator app method is recommended. I am going to choose the text message SMS method and click Continue. Select an existing phone number or add a new phone number for two-factor authentication and then click continue. Enter the six-digit code that you receive via SMS text message. Click on continue. Two-factor authentication for Facebook Protect has now been turned on. If there is any attempt to log in from an unrecognized device or browser, you will receive a verification code to this phone number. Click on done. You're all set with Facebook Protect now. Click on Done and you can continue using Facebook as usual. I make technology-based information and review videos in this channel. If you like my video, please consider subscribing to follow my future video contents. I hope to see you in my next video.